today we're making a holiday drink for you that I think you're really going to love. It is similar to eggnog. It'll remind you of that. This is a Puerto Rican drink called Coquito. Have you heard of it? So Coquito actually means little coconut. So it's a coconut based drink as opposed to eggnog, which is egg based, right? And the flavors are very similar, but a little bit different as well. So if you love coconut, you're gonna love this. So in making this recipe, I've tried to do a couple of things. One is to use quality ingredients, and I'm gonna go over those with you in just a minute, so you, know, you can see what's in there. And I tried to cut back a little bit on the sugar because I didn't think it needed to be quite so sweet is what I typically see online. So I'm Rockin' Robin, and I'm gonna show you how to make this delicious creamy drink right after my chef joke. All right, so I'm gonna start off here with chef joke number one, and number two will be a little bit later, so hang around for that. All right, here we go. So who tells the best eggnog jokes? Comedy hens. <laughs> okay, so here's our ingredients. I'm gonna start off here by talking about my organic coconut milk. I'm using this brand here, uh, Native Harvest, and no gargums. I mean, it's really the cleanest thing I've ever seen. So check out these ingredients here. We've got organic coconut milk. And it's basically just organic coconut and water. Next up, I'm using cream of coconut here. This is where the sugar is gonna lie, guys, and I can't kid you. So I've cut back on using the amount of this because the, the sugar content is incredibly high. The ingredient list is pretty clean, better than some of the other brands that I looked at. And so this, that's why I went with this one. So my next two ingredients are evaporated milk, and I'm using organic, and sweetened condensed milk. Again, I cut back on the sweetened condensed milk because there's a ton of sugar in that. Now for the rest of our ingredients, we're gonna be using some ground cinnamon. This is some nutmeg, which I'm gonna freshly grate. Vanilla extract. I have some rum extract, which is really kind of optional, but I think the flavor is kind of nice. And a little bit of almond extract. So all we have to do is place everything into a blender. So I'm gonna take my coconut milk and just toss it right in. This is the cream of coconut. You can see it's nice and thick and it doesn't get hard when it gets cold because we're gonna be refrigerating this uh, mixture until we wanna serve it. And we certainly want it to get cold before we serve it. And if you wanna put alcohol in here, you can do it at any point before we mix. Here's the evaporated milk, pour that in. Now this recipe certainly can be doubled or tripled depending on how big your group is. You might wanna make more, but this makes a fair amount. Here's the sweetened condensed milk. Here goes our cinnamon. Vanilla extract, which brings out some sweetness as well. Add a little bit of rum extract. Again, this one's optional. But if you're not adding the alcohol, I kinda like to add it for a little flavor. A little bit of almond flavor in there. And you can get all the uh, written in, you know, ingredients in the description of this video. So it's down there, you know, along with all my other uh, social media you know, links. And then I'm gonna add some freshly grated nutmeg. Now, when you do freshly grated, I think it's so much better. You're gonna do, you know, not too much, it's like a pinch. Then you, would, you could add your alcohol, and then now we're gonna blend it up. Like I said, this is very simple to make. It's, you know, you can do it ahead of time. It's great for parties. So I'm just gonna place it right here and blend away. And then what you can do is put it into a jar with a lid so you can seal it up and it'll be good for about a week. We'll place a lid on that and put it in the refrigerator. Okay, it's time for chef joke number two. Are you ready? Here we go. Why did the eggnog go to school? to get educated. All right, so this is one quick recipe, right? It makes a nice gift too. If you've got some bottles with the little seal on the top, you could make these up and give them out as Christmas gifts. You know, you go to somebody's house. So after you chill this, you wanna drink this cold, right? This isn't quite cold yet, but that's okay. I'm gonna taste it anyway. It looks nice and creamy. You can garnish it up with, you know, either a, a little splash of cinnamon or nutmeg, you can grate some nutmeg over there, and you could even just take a, a cinnamon stick and just stick it right in there. So let's give it a taste. And that's nice. Reminds me of eggnog for sure. Not too sweet because I cut it back and I think it's, it's plenty sweet. It's delicious, it's creamy. It's got that cinnamon, it's got that nutmeg. 
You're gonna love this. Some of you might wanna try a traditional eggnog recipe and I've got you covered. So I'm gonna leave a link for you right here on the screen. You can check it out. It's easy to make, it's delicious as usual. And I tell you, I think you'll really love it. So thanks so much for watching today. If you enjoyed today's video, let me know by smashing the like button. I always love to hear from you. So also leave me a comment and have a happy holiday. We'll see you next time. Take care.